this, which is destroying your computer. When you put USB in there, it goes in, it's nice and tight. But what happens is, this can is with about a wireless mouse. And now I'm going to show you a um, product review. My daughter's been using this mouse. It's the advanced full size mouse from Logitech. And I think there's a, I don't know if there's a, a, a part from here. This is a kind of a review and an unboxing and to show you how this works and how simple it is. I did this on my daughter's computer yesterday and it was fantastic. Easiest pie. If you've got Windows 10, which most people, sorry, if, if, I've got Windows 7, actually, you know, I've just realized I'm running Windows 7 on this machine. My daughter's machine was Windows 10. It worked like a dream. Um, so I don't know if it'll need me to download any drivers. We'll soon find out. But all we need to do, all I needed to do on my daughter's machine was plug this in. It downloaded the hardware, the software from this doofer, switched it on, bing, bong, bang. This also has two batteries, uh, two AA batteries. So you don't need to get anything else, 30 bucks. There's different types of mouses that they do. This is the better one I've found. This is a nice, big, solid mouse. This is, this is the advanced full-size wireless mouse. So I'm gonna show you how you install it. A review, I would say, I'll tell you now, it was dead easy to install. As far as I can see, it was, she, she hasn't come back and, and said, Daddy, I want my old mouse back, this is crap. You've got a left and right mouse button, you've got a tracker wheel, and you've got a forward and back button. I'm not sure what that does. I think that moves the page forwards and backwards. I'll have a little have a play around with it. But And it's got one of these, can you see? There's a different type of dongle. Can you see the like little, uh, uh, can't show you. Can you see it's like a little mark here? It means it's like the, it's like a, not a universal, I've forgotten what they call it now. Uh, unified or something. Um, so you can, you, you can use one dongle to, to power six up to six devices. So I think, I mean, Walmart were doing a combo, uh, a keyboard um, mouse combo for 24 bucks, cheaper than one of these, but I think the mouse was slightly different. So essentially you can have one dongle and have a wireless keyboard and whatever. I believe, now someone said these are paired, but I think if you have this one with a little dot on it, it's the unifying one which means it can run up to six uh, devices. You, you pair it, you, there's no pairing, you just switch it on, it sees it and it's done. I don't know, I haven't done that bit, we're just gonna do this. So, um, I'm gonna put it on pause, I'm gonna cut this open and I'm gonna show you, actually, I'm gonna show you the best way to cut these open, is get a sharp knife and get into the corners and go all the way around. So, come back to you in a minute. And as I said, don't try pulling this crap and cutting, just get a knife Go right around, it's really easy to put. Once you, you stick it, you can go around. And you should come out like that. There's nothing else in here. And this is the mouse. Woohoo! Mousey, mousey, mousey. Okay, I'm gonna go one hand styly again. So this is the mouse. It's a nice nice mouse, I like it. You've got this is the on-off button. Okay. When this comes on. When you power it on, you'll see there's a light here. So to do it, you kind of push that there. You pull this tab out. And it's nice to see actually that Logitech are using Duracell batteries. I love Duracell. Duracell are the thing in the UK. They are the, the mutts nuts. Now, the first time I got this, I was looking around. So where's the dongle? The dongle's supposed to be here somewhere. Where's the dongle? Can't find it. Then I was looking, I thought maybe it's in there, I can't see it. Then, can you see here? Dongle! So this is good, if you want to move your thingy bob, and you don't want to lose your dongle, your dongle is here. So let's pull the dongle out. There we go. And this is a little thing I was telling you about. Can you see? Can you see that little orange mark? Can you see, so actually, can you see, I hadn't noticed before, but it's there like six star, it's like six pointed star. I think that means you can use six devices. And according to the Logitech website, that's what it meant. So, what we do is we just close this back up again. And then, can you see here? Off and on. Off, on. 
Da -da! your light to show you that you've got power. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to power my machine up. And then come back in a minute once it's powered up. Right, so from the power of the, the internet, I've powered it up. So now I'm just thinking the only thing I need to do is just, I'm going to put it in the one which works, I know. Put that in there. Yeah, you see? It's installing. Device is ready. Do you think the mouse is going to move? Look at that. It's a simplicity, and this is on a Windows 7 machine. And let's go here, let's get one of my, uh, let's go pictures. I want to see double click. Double click works. Single click, which is the, sorry, left, that was left click, this is right click, so right click works. And then if I, I want to get a document. I've got a document here, I think, one of my, uh, here we go, and uh, this is the scroll. Can you see the scroll? Nice. Now this is the front and back button. I'm not really sure what it does, but let's try. I can't see what it does. There may be a reason for that. I have no idea, but there you go. It, it works. It took all of 10 seconds. And you know, what I'm gonna do is, let's try this, let's, Put the machine to sleep there's two ways what we can do usually i'll put my machine to sleep so i'm going to put it to sleep okay let's see if it sees it Woohoo! even after sleep mode it sees it that's good so what about a shutdown what happens after a shutdown shut feels the good down. this really feels nice i'm just going to see compare it with the with the dell with the dell the Dell is nice, so I've got three mice here. I've got the HP, it just is wrong. I mean, it's not bad, but it's just wrong. It feels wrong. This is the bit, can you see? And if you can see my thumb, that bit there, this, this bit here, this bit here hurts. It's really not a good mouse. This is a lot better because this bit is high, it's an, like an arch. Can you see? It doesn't go in as much, but this, oh my gosh. This is so much better. Now I have a gaming mouse at work. I'm gonna try and run off on Tuesday and pick that up because that's definitely a good mouse, but this is better. So you can put this into a laptop bag, okay? You can move it around. You don't have to worry. You're gonna save your USBs. I would definitely you know, you get do? one of these. Still keep your a wired mouse in the bag. Because like, if this breaks for whatever reason, uh, you know, the something happens, you or you lose it, or the batteries, or anything, you've still got a, a backup. But this, like, if you're not going to be moving this all the time, you yeah, know, man, this is crazy. I love this. I really, really am loving this. So let's go back onto my profile. spinny wheel. And, oh, fantastic. Now, let's do one more test. I have other profiles on here, so let me switch to the uh, Look, look, it's working. Fantastic. You know, I'm really happy with this. There's very, very few products which give you, when you get home, you think, I spent money, and you get buyer's remorse, and oh, I didn't, I shouldn't have spent. This is worth every penny. Now, just as a kind of, uh, uh, like a, a, a comment, this was 34 bucks there's another one which is a bit cheaper but this i like the feel of this one the other one was a bit smaller logitech do a combo which the keyboard looks nice but it was a it was a seal because of its covid i guess i could have opened it but i didn't want to get into trouble but i don't know if the mouse was this kind of mouse but i noticed it didn't have this on there this sign on here so I may not have been able to use that mouse or the keyboard with the mouse or whatever. So I, I didn't get it, but that mouse, the keyboard mouse combo was like 24 bucks, which is cheaper than this. So you think if this is 34 and they're going to do two products for less than this, how much are they making and how much, what are you losing as a product? So I decided not to do that. So uh, let's round, round this up. If you have a laptop and you have one of these, 
with one of these, you're going to have problems with your USB. Okay, whether you plug it in correctly, whether you make sure it's done nicely and neatly, every time you plug this in and out, you're having wear and tear. Okay, if you think about plugs, you know, the plug sockets, mains plug sockets, generally the plugs which last the longest the connections are the ones which you leave plugged in. Every time you pull it out and plug it in and pull it out and plug it in, something's going to wear, something's going to give, and it's usually the contacts. Okay, so you can, depending if you're electrically inclined, you can replace a, a plug point, plug socket, uh, 10, 15, 20 bucks, something like that. If you bust a USB connection on your laptop, you're looking at a couple of things. One, do you know how to change it? The newer boards, the newer machines coming out are so small and compact, everything is all on one board. And I bet you a pound to a penny, if you get an Apple iMac or a new Dell or a new whatever, you're not going to be able to change that board. You're not. You're, you're stuffed. You'll have to unsolder the USB and put a new one on. And you're back to square on because you're going to still break it. And if you can, are you confident to take your $300, $400, whatever laptop apart? And change the board out is it is the board available so look what all i'm saying is why tempt fate it's costing you nothing it's costing you 30 bucks for a mouse and as i said i would say if you're going anywhere have your wired mouse it doesn't matter you like once in a while you're plugging things it doesn't matter but you know we are plugging things in every day we put the machine to sleep take the mouse out take the thing but the other point of failure on my on my uh, laptop is uh, the power thingy, you know, you've seen some of my other videos on this power thingy. It's uh, messed up because you're pulling I'm, in, pulling I'm out. I think I've, I'm hoping, and I think, I've helped a few YouTubers, and non-YouTubers, with this startling discovery. Is it discovery? I haven't, let me know, put, put some comments in the comments below. Is this something that would have occurred to you that is a point of failure? and how to get around it. Have you seen any videos on YouTube uh, saying, hey, to protect your, to save your USB, get a wireless USB? I don't think I have. If you have, you know, this is maybe, I've discovered something. Maybe they'll, they'll name this discovery after me. Jay's theory on USB management for laptops. <laughs> All right, so listen. Uh, thanks a lot for uh, tuning in. I hope this video helped you and if you think this video is going to help someone else Please uh, let someone else know if there's anything about this video you didn't like come and tell me not a problem at all um, And if you liked it, please tell me and tell others and of course like and subscribe mash that mash that like button and hit subscribe and uh, I'll try and get some more videos. Out. I've got another video. I'm trying to do. I'm not sure if I'm going to have time Um between you and me, it's about a present that Mary Lou got for is getting from Santa Claus. And I don't want it to hear. I might do it, I'm not sure. Uh, and also, I may not be able to post I, I really want to post this other video before Christmas to warn you guys. It's a, it's a, it's a, a warning. I'm, I'm going to give it a try. I might do that. But anyway, this video is over and done with. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. From yours truly, BJ and Jason. Peace out, Yintia. I'm out of here like a thief tonight. God bless you.